the custom shape tool. Photoshop Elements has the custom shape tool and the cookie cutter tool. Very quick, useful tool for creating frame designs as well as cropping designs as well. Just going to quickly go to the cookie cutter tool, select that. Now here's some Easter egg designs. This is could be on PC or Mac. These, so I'm going to select one of these and Easter egg designs from graphicextras.com. So just quickly apply the cookie cutter tool straight away. You, know, you can move the design around. It's a vector design, so it can be any size. You can transform it in many ways. You can rotate it so you can get highlight a particular element of a picture. Click OK. Just get rid of that. Undo cookie cutter tool. And just going to select another design. There's one there. And you can also feather the design, create a slightly blurring around the edges of the design. So, so 10, 10 points, and I'm just going to apply it now. Now, it's not actually interactive, unfortunately, the blur, so you can only see it once you've uh, clicked OK. So click OK, now you can just see very uh, faint part of the image now. Click Undo, and just reduce that down to zero. And you can also do crop. So I'm just going to... Go and maybe select another shape and just drag that, just that little area there, reduce it down, and then the entire document is just cropped to the size of the uh, the actual custom shape tool. I might say custom shapes are vector designs, so they can be any size, so they work well with any document.